So you might be in a situation where you want to go ahead and stop your Android phone from updating. Now there's a few ways that, you know, there's a few ways that this can be described. I'm not 100% too sure what you want to do, but if your phone is currently going through an update, like you see the Android logo or you see it actually like doing a loading bar and it's actually installing the update on your phone, there's really not much you can do. You can go ahead and just you know, leave your phone as it is. And that's probably what I'd recommend doing. If you start clicking buttons or trying to turn your phone off, it's actually not good for your device. And if you have to cancel or abort an update like that, it's never really going to work out properly. I've done that before and I've broken a lot of Android phones like that. So the best thing to do, just leave your phone plugged in and that can help increase, I think, the speed of the update. As long as it's charged up, you should be good. However, if you're downloading an update, let's say you're downloading an update and it's going to install in like two seconds or 10 seconds, what I'd recommend doing is just as quickly as possible holding down the buttons as you normally would to go ahead and restart your phone and just powering off your device. This is probably the easiest way if your phone is constantly telling you about an update, just restart your phone and that could probably end up fixing the problem for some people. Now what you can also try doing is going into your settings application if you want to see this update. So scroll down until you see a system panel right here, go and tap into here and what you're going to want to do here is click on system update and it will probably tell you if there's an update available. Now, it's going to tell you a few things here, but if you see this panel, you can just leave this panel as it is. You don't have to go and update your phone. So if you want to cancel an update, you just basically means you don't have to do anything. Just don't go on this panel and don't click on restart now, because if it restarts your device, then it's going to automatically go and install that update. On top of that, if your phone is constantly either giving you a pop-up that, hey, you know, you need to restart your phone or whatever, you can do this if you want. I don't know if you have to do this, but if you want to, you could stop notifications from your settings application, at least temporarily for the most part. So you can go ahead and go into your notifications panel here. You could go into either app notifications or your notification history, and you can turn off your particular, you know, application settings, like you can turn off like settings, the particular app for your updates, and that will stop the settings application from giving you updates and giving you pop-ups. So you can do settings, settings services. That's also another thing you can do, but those are pretty much the main ways to go and fix this problem. So. That pretty much covers it up there. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I got you guys in the next video. Peace out.